Hey guys, welcome to Dedicated. My name is Andy, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to remove this tub. So, I'm remodeling this bathroom, and this is one of the series videos I'm doing. So, before you can remove this tub, you got to make sure that all the tile around it is out in, in the cement board. Because as you can see, there's this lip right here that would be holding the tub. So, if you want to see how I did mine, you can click on the cards right over here. And you can see my demolition video. Let's begin. So first, we're going to remove this drain plug. And in order to remove the cap, there is a set screw right over here that you got to remove. Right over there, see? Right there. So it's just the Phillips head. Just like that, comes right off. So take the vacuum and clean up the drain because we're gonna put a tool in there to unscrew that. Take some channel locks and unscrew this little guy right here. Like this is basically what holds the cap together. So in order to remove that, which is attached to the plumbing and screws in, you need a special tool like this. I'm not really sure what it's called, but it's fairly inexpensive. You can get it on Amazon or at Home Depot or Lowe's. Just ask the employee for a drain removal tool for the tub. So that's, that's what we're gonna use. And basically there's two different sizes. As you can see, we're gonna be using the bigger size and then you have this hole that you can put the screwdriver to turn it, to help you turn it. Or you can use channel locks, but it's easier to do it with the screwdriver. Never mind, we're gonna use the little one. screwdriver. We're gonna bring out the big guns. There we go. There we go. That's what it looks like. Next, we're gonna remove this guy. Just like that. So I recommend wearing some gloves for this, just cause you don't wanna cut yourself or anything like that. So if you have these kind of gloves, put them on. If not, you can get some at Home Depot or Amazon. Any gloves will do. And that's it, and that's how you remove it. So now you can clean it up, put a new tub, or convert it into a shower, which is what I'm going to be doing. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.